Hey guys, Derek here from Modern Castle. The Samsung Bespoke Jet Vacuum is not only a stick vacuum, but one with an auto empty base. The clean station greatly reduces daily maintenance and acts as a charging base as well. Furthermore, the vacuum had excellent performance in our tests. It's a bit pricey, but usability, performance, and modern aesthetics cannot be overstated. Let's start with our performance tests. We use six different tests to measure the cleaning performance and usability of the Bespoke Jet. First up, our cleaning tests. To test cleaning performance of the Samsung Bespoke Jet Vacuum, we use four different debris types on three different floor types. We then use the vacuum on max suction power and clean up the debris, after which we check how much of the debris was removed by weight. Cleaning performance for the Samsung Bespoke Jet was excellent in all cases except one, serial on hardwood flooring. In all other tests, it was able to remove the vast majority of debris, occasionally leaving minimal amounts behind. On hardwood, 85% of the total cereal was removed. However, it was a difficult task for the Samsung Bespoke to complete. When pushing the vacuum over the cereal, it would push the majority of it instead, only picking up a few pieces at a time. In the end, the majority of the 85% that was removed was done due to the cereal breaking into smaller pieces over time. Unlike the issues mentioned regarding hardwood flooring, the Samsung Bespoke Jet Vacuum experienced virtually no issues on low pile and high pile carpet. On both floor types, minimal amounts of sugar and kitty litter remain, but the vacuum was able to get on top of the larger debris and remove it completely. Our long hair tests check how well a vacuum is able to clean long hair without it tangling around the brush roll. To test this, we place long strands of synthetic hair in the direct cleaning path of the Samsung Bespoke, run the vacuum over it, and check the floor and brush roll. All of the hair was removed from the floor. No problems there. However, a moderate amount of the hair did tangle around the brush roll. Luckily, removing the hair was easy to do by hand and it didn't cause any major issues. However, if you commonly clean up long hair, make sure to keep an eye on the brush roll to remove tangles. For the pet hair test, we nestled pet hair into high power carpet. We then ran the Samsung Bespoke Jet Vacuum on max suction setting over the fur. After, we checked to see how much of the pet hair was removed from the carpet. Pet hair performance for the Bespoke is exceptional, with one caveat. You need to use the pet tool to achieve this performance. With the standard cleaning head, the performance was good, but nothing amazing. When we switched to the pet tool, the majority of the hair was removed with only a few strands remaining in the carpet. To test the runtime, we fully charged the battery and let the vacuum run on each mode until the battery runs out of power. All of our runtime tests are based on a single battery. In our test, we measured a runtime of 56 minutes and 3 seconds on the lowest power setting and 9 minutes and 59 seconds on the max setting. Runtime for the Samsung Bespoke Jet Vacuum is fairly standard compared to other cordless vacuums we've tested. However, Samsung included an additional battery with the Bespoke, effectively doubling the runtime. If one runs out, you simply switch in the backup and continue cleaning. As an added bonus, the accessory cradle can not only charge a battery, but easily be carried around to have your tools and extra battery close at hand. For our noise test of the Samsung Bespoke, we ran it on each setting on high power carpet. While running, we measured the level of noise generated with a noise meter from about 3 feet away. Our testing showed the Bespoke Jet to have a noise range of 51 to 61 decibels depending on the mode. When self-emptying, it makes 53.3 decibels of noise. Across the board, this isn't a quiet vacuum, however, it's similar to most other high-performance cordless sticks we've tested to date. Here's what it sounds like running in each mode. And here's what it sounds like when self-emptying. Overall usability for the Samsung Bespoke is fantastic. Setup is quick and easy, the controls are intuitive, and maintenance is excellent thanks to the clean station. It's lightweight, easy to maneuver, and lays practically flat on the ground. In addition, it comes with a wide range of accessories and tools that assist in cleaning. Setup is incredibly simple for the Samsung Bespoke. There is a little more required thanks to the clean station, but it still only takes 5-10 to 10 minutes for a single person to set up. Samsung does recommend fully charging the battery before first use, which they estimate takes 3.5 hours. The battery can be charged while attached to the vacuum in the clean station, 
or in the accessory cradle. Controlling the Samsung Bespoke Jet Vacuum is straightforward thanks to the three-button design and display. The center button powers the vacuum on and off, while the plus and minus shaped buttons adjust the suction power. The display is simple and will convey information about the bespoke, such as remaining battery life, current suction power, and maintenance notifications. In addition, there is a button on the clean station itself that starts and stops a self-empty cycle. Overall maintenance for the Samsung Bespoke Jet Vacuum is excellent. This is largely due to the clean station. It takes care of the most frequent maintenance task, emptying the dustbin. Instead, when the vacuum is placed on the dock and the self-empty button is pressed, the station will empty out the dustbin into an internal dust bag. However, there was one issue we experienced with this feature. After self-emptying, the dustbin would remain open, requiring the user to close it after. It isn't a huge issue, but it caught us off guard the first time as we turned the vacuum on with the dustbin open. Other tasks like washing the filters on the station and vacuum or replacing the dust bag on the clean station will need to be done by hand, but less frequently. Included with the Samsung Bespoke Jet Vacuum are a variety of tools and accessories that assist in cleaning. It has a standard combination tool and a crevice tool that can extend further if needed. In addition, it comes with an adjustable height for increased or decreased length. The Jet Dual Brush is the standard cleaning head that can be used on all surfaces. It uses a single brush roll and mini soft brush roll on the front to tackle most messes. Unlike the Jet Dual Brush, the Pet Tool is designed to tackle specific messes. Its smaller design and rubber brush roll are designed to handle pet hair with ease and reduce tangling. Finally, the flexible tool enhances other cleaning accessories by adding additional angles to tackle messes. If you are looking to add even more accessories to enhance your cleaning, the wet brush adds mopping functionality and the slim action brush is a lightweight, more maneuverable cleaning head. Samsung's latest stick vacuum, the Bespoke Jet, had fantastic performance across all of our tests. It removed 98.1% of debris in our cleaning test, tackled hair removal with the <laughs> tackled hair removing hair removey. Hair removey, baby. <laughs> tackled hair removal with only minor tangling, and smashed our pet hair test. It comes with a variety of tools and accessories that enhance the cleaning experience, most notably the clean station. This reduces overall maintenance and acts as a charging dock as well. It's a bit pricey, but the performance and convenience cannot be overstated. It's an exceptionally high performance and easy to use cordless stick. Well guys, that's it for this video. I hope you found it helpful. Comments, questions, please drop us those notes down below. If you're interested in buying the bespoke, we've got a link in the description. For more from Modern Castle, be sure to get subscribed, ring that bell, and visit our ModernCastle.com. As always, thank you so much for watching.